Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to another episode of a game called Evolution. You guys have been really enjoying this, and I have too. It's a lot of fun to create weird jumping sharks that jump and balls that don't roll. <laughs> Look at him go. Look how the tail even swings back and forth. Anyway, you guys have given me some really, really, really good suggestions on what to build today. Uh, so if you do have a suggestion what you'd like to see next episode, go ahead and drop that down below in the comments section and we'll do the best we can to get to those. So today, there's one thing that I wanted to check out. Um, can I just clear it? Creature. There we go. One thing I wanted to check out was somebody said to make two bones like this. Uh, yep, we'll just, it doesn't matter. We'll make two bones on the sides and connect it with a muscle <laughs> and see what happens. I mean, I have, I have literally have no idea. I think if I go to jumping, it might work. Whoa, <laughs> what? What's going on? Whoa, I think the game, whoop, the best of generation one, the muscle, wow. <laughs> what? Okay, that's going to. I wonder what happens if we let it roll for a long time. Oh, nothing's going to happen. It's just going to give a seizure. Okay, so <laughs> that didn't work right. Um, I mean, that's kind of funny, but I, I like it. Uh, another thing that you guys have been suggesting is doing a square and then connecting everything inside like this. So that's all I can do. Okay, let's try this one out. Uh, 40 population, seven seconds. That seems fine. Now this, you guys said, actually works. Oh wow, they're pretty cool looking. They're almost, oh look at those little guys. You see the two on the side, they're starting to run. Oh, that was backwards. Hey, hey, <laughs> they're bouncing away. Go, go, go little fellas. So even just 15 generations in, these guys are learning pretty well. Uh, some of them are. <laughs> they're, oh, okay, maybe not. <laughs> but I do like watching them one at a time. The boing, oh, he tipped over. Oh, that's funny. He, he went on his point. There, oh yeah, so um, some of them really start to learn how to go. Oh, that's the wrong way. Oh, look at these guys. No, wait, that's starting over again. Hey, look, oh, I wanna go, give me, yes. I mean, let's look at the ones on the right. Wee. oh, man, they're not doing so great. But I, they are working, kind of surprising. I'm not, I'm, I wasn't expecting a bunch of jumping boxes to work. So at 30 generations, about the same thing's happening. It just bounces. Everything bounces and bounces and bounces. I was wondering what happened if we made a giant square. Giganto square. I hope I, I hope I counted the numbers right. Should be 22 on each side. I guess some of you might pause it and tell me your blitz, you're a little bit off. Oop, whoop. And then we'll go up here. And finish. Perfect. Okay. Um try it. Evolve. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> I have no idea what's happening. Whoop! Oh, hey, wait! It folded up on itself. Is it too? The muscle's not strong enough. Wee! <laughs> Some of them might work after a while. Oh wow! You see, they're trying to flip around like a uh, origami. So that didn't work. <laughs> it was cool to look at, but it didn't really work. I wanted to try one more neat thing, kind of in the vein of our bouncing wheel that we made before, but just a little bit different design. So this is actually from uh, one of the patrons, Marcus who's in the end slate of the videos. He's giving me some good things on the Discord server. I wanna try this one out, so it looks kinda of cool. So let's try that. Oh, we, we got the jumping on. That might've been why some of these weren't working. Okay, let's try running on this one. Whoa, <laughs> they're rolling. Oh, and they're jumping. What's going on? This is cool. Hey, oh, look at this first one go. First generation, look at it bounce. What? What? These things are awesome. Wow. That was amazing how that one flew. Yay, go. Oh, they roll so well. I think the secret on these things is making it like an octagon. Is that the right word? Octa, octahedron? Oh, and it has eight sides because it kind of goes into a square mode as it jumps. This thing is working really, really, really well. I wonder what happens if we take it. Oh, that one got stuck. Um, some of these are just killing it on uh, how far they go. Um, there we go. Look at these guys. Ooh, boing. <laughs> and boing. I got too many of them on the screen, I think. But it is really interesting how they jump. Like, they're they're killing it. I love it. Man, it's all working together. Just a big floating, like, weird thing. I absolutely love this one. And somebody also suggested just to put down a bunch of points and then connect them together and see what happens. I mean, this could be fun. It's like uh, those... When you're a kid and you played those games where it was... Uh, or, like, you did the coloring books where you had to connect certain things, like connect the dots, I think it was called. 
Yes, we'll try this out. <laughs> it might be really, really, really strange. I have no idea what this thing's supposed to do or where it's gonna go. I'm gonna connect this little back foot to everything. Connect these up together. This little back foot's gonna go here. We, we don't know, maybe this will create the best thing ever. Uh, connect both of those up like that. Throw this one on to, I don't know, here? Sure, and jump, running, running. We're gonna make the, the Wiggle Monster run. Whoa, hey, what? This isn't supposed to work. You're not, why do we spend time making things that go good? <laughs> Look at it go though. Look at the, the best of generation, it's working. This is amazing. Let's do a bit of a progress report. It's running. This The thing is alive and it's running. It's front legs and then it kind of pushes that back leg out. It is so creepy. And it's got like this one over here. Wait, wait, can I pause it? No, oh, I, I wish I could pause it. Uh, that, it's got like a little face on it. Oh, it's so weird. <laughs> like, why do I try to make interesting and unique things when I can just plop down a bunch of buttons and hook it up? Oh, that one kind of, that one's, that one's going bad though. I want to let this run for like 150 and see what happens. All right, we've cracked 100 generations of our galloping horse. Look at it go. Look at it go. But up, but up, but up. Uh oh. Some of them still go a little bit dumb. Uh, some of them, yeah, see it go as a pack. Oh, some of them get tripped up too. I love it. Man, that's the cool thing about this game is you can just try random stuff and it works. And sometimes it doesn't work and it ends up in a big failure. I think. Part of the problem is overthinking the game, uh, trying to overthink and overdoing it. Uh, Cause it, like the human I made back a long time ago didn't didn't really work at all. I might've overthought it. And uh, if I'd go back and, and try it again, I might be able to get it to work. Uh, but this is cool. I like this guy going. Uh, so I wanted to try today. I also wanted to try, I'm gonna go back. We're gonna save this as the horse, horse, save it. <laughs> I mean, it looks like a mess there, doesn't it? Um, but I wanted to go back and I wanted to create maybe a dinosaur and I was thinking uh, like a, a, a Patasaurus or a Bronchiosaurus something with a long neck that kind of goes boop, 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 boop. That's really bad. I need to zoom out. Oh boy <laughs> It looks kind of recognizable as a dinosaur doesn't it? He <laughs> is stick dino. Okay, um, so if I'm gonna make it work, oh, this is gonna be tough. <laughs> His neck is just gonna go blah, 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 blah. I think if I connected it backwards, it might work better. Connect the head down. Oh boy, that's gonna be so messy. Okay, we'll do this. We'll have to connect the legs back too, right? I think so. Connect the legs back, maybe forward as well. We'll do a one forward, two back. Okay, then the tail. Gotta connect those to the tail. Tail to the butt. Tail to the butt. Oh boy, no idea what to do here. I guess we'll combine these together. And, oh, I need to do it backwards, right? If I do it backwards, then it'll try to pull itself up. We need to pull the legs up the best we can. Okay, let's just try that and see what happens. For, whoa, 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 too powerful. So this doesn't work at all, which I kind of expected. Um, the neck kind of stretches out. Like, the neck in the front kind of stretches to get some distance. And the tail comes forward. Uh, I don't know if this guy's gonna work. I mean, like I said, overcomplicating things. So I went ahead and I moved up all of these together. Maybe I should connect the backbone too. Um, and I've created a rib cage, thinking this might might help. If I connect all these together, um, it might work. I don't know. We'll just see. I, what I didn't like happening was, oh, it's kind of maybe working? What I didn't like happening in that it was just falling flat on the ground. And that's kind of what's happening still. Um, yeah, I don't... I guess I need to connect the legs to the shoulder. Should probably do that here. Bone to that. And maybe to there. Because the, the leg kind of should go back, right? And we'll connect that one to there and that one to there. Okay, we'll try this again. I can kind of tell that we need to give it some more leg muscles. If we look at one at a time here. they The legs stay up. This, this back one doesn't. We probably need to reinforce that better. Um, maybe bring it back to that joint instead. But the legs uh, don't have any muscles to propel it forward. So I'm thinking if I create another joint here, connect these bones up, and then delete this one, and move that back to here. Add some muscles in and combine these things just a bit. It might work a little bit better. Okay, we're about 50 generations in, and I think I figured out why the dinosaurs went extinct. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the head falls down, and then somehow it's butt comes up in the air like why 
Um, not not sure what's happening. I th think one of the problems I've been facing is trying to get these feet to work better. Now, I think if I attach that foot back another one, and then maybe uh, I reinforce that front leg too, it's more solid now, so the feet aren't doing anything <laughs> except being like stability. Oh, man. The perfect... <laughs> I love how his butt goes up. Let's try to... Let's try to bump this up to like uh, 30 seconds and just see what will happen with it. I think it's going to eventually, it'll roll. Uh, maybe not. I don't know. We'll see with this one. Okay, so this should be the full 30 seconds. There's the butt going over. And then what happens now? It just it just sits upside down <laughs> with a broken neck. Oh, no, it's not working right. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm going to work on this a little bit between the videos today and uh, the next one. See if I can figure out anything else. Also, if you have any suggestions on what you'd like to see uh, playing in Evolution, go ahead and let me know. I thought it would be fun to try a dinosaur today. Uh, ultimately, this is probably one of the harder dinosaurs to make. Maybe we'll do like a, a raptor next time or a T-Rex or something. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know. And keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.